This is Haley, and it's time for the grind. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. Good morning, Lincoln County High School. It is Monday. Monday, the 29th. 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 April 29th. April 29th. The year of our Lord, 2013. 13, yes. <laughs> I have just a couple of things. The big one is uh, we have a visit tomorrow from the State Department, and uh, those folks will come in and kind of help us out a little bit and let us see what's going on. I just want you, you teachers and, and students to be quite honest with them. They will come into your classrooms, maybe pull you out and interview for you a little bit, uh, just kind of see what's going on at Lincoln County High School. And we just want to make sure that we're, we're doing good things here. Yeah, I, I really think we are. I mean, there's been a mm -hmm. lot of really cool things that happen uh, just in the last couple weeks, uh, we've had uh, the Shakespeare Festival. Shakespeare Festival. Shakespeare Festival was awesome. Prom. Prom. Uh, everybody made it back. I only heard of one accident. It was a slight <laughs> fender bender prior to prom. Yes, it wasn't even during prom. Uh, mock accident. Mock accident mm -hmm. was uh, phenomenal. Uh, by the way, that mock accident footage is online now, so check it out. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it was really cool. I mean, the makeup that those guys did was, was phenomenal, phenomenal, and yeah. some of it wasn't even shown, but I loved every <laughs> bit of it. Like, yeah, kudos the, to Mr. Barton and his class. Oh wow, that yeah. was that was top of the line stuff. I mean, the bone coming out of the arm, yeah. the glass, glass, the gurgling blood flow, <laughs> the guts laying on the uh, hood, the yeah. guts. Yeah. Uh, I wasn't quite sold on the cottage cheese for brains. I think it got a little too hot, and the, they melted, yeah. and so it just looked like you know vomit. But yeah. it was yeah. it was okay. It was okay. Um, Shakespeare Festival stuff will be up through Wednesday. Okay. Speaking so. of Shakespeare Festival, I just want to thank you guys and tell you how proud I am of you. That was a school-wide initiative. Took a lot of folks, a lot of hard energy, a lot of time to make that happen. So kudos to you guys. Appreciate all that you the, do. The performances were phenomenal. Yes, phenomenal. I, Fighting scenes. The, the fight sword. scenes. Yes. Yeah. I mean, just the, the cat fight. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that was that was The Doctor Who, I don't think everybody got the Doctor I Who bit. I love the Doctor Who bit. You have to have a little bit of Doctor Who knowledge. Yes, you do. To understand what that was all about. And I, I think he played it off really well. I do, too. I do. I mean, yes. for, the, for, for those few nerds of us out there that got it, <laughs> we really appreciate it. It was really like, good. Literally, like, I was running late. I was, it was a busy day. I came in, and I walked in to drop off a severed head for Mr. Barton, and then I saw it. I was like, oh. <laughs> I was gushing for like 10 minutes. I was like, there's a Dalek. I was like, oh. So I took like a bunch of pictures, threw it up on my Instagram. Cool. Made a, yeah, it was, it was made a Vine video. It was great. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, prom. I'm going to read this message that came in the email this morning in case anybody hasn't had a chance to read it yet. Uh, we want to thank everyone that came out to help us make prom a success. We want to give a big thank you to Dallas and Leanne Pumley for setting up the backgrounds. That was a huge help. Uh, Mr. Spinagle for the and his kids for the Eiffel Tower, which is in my garage right now because <laughs> he couldn't bring it home. Couldn't get it home. He couldn't fit it in his truck. Wouldn't fit. <clears throat> anyway, uh, for the Eiffel Tower and for all the students for their hard work, we also appreciate Miss Swan, of course, myself, and Mr. Lambert, who were there till 2 a.m. And Miss Teresa Ryan. And Miss Teresa Ryan, who suffered it all. She was on poopy <laughs> duty, I think, the entire day. Every time I went back to the water fountain, she was back there by the bathrooms. And then she, of course, rode the bus yeah, home. To and from. To yeah. and from. Oh, that was And I want to say that Lincoln County by far has the uh, prettiest girls in the state and the most handsome men in the state, no doubt about that. <gasps> Wee man, I have to give you the shout out, buddy. <laughs> You were, my wife was just talking about you the entire, she, you were her, like, she just couldn't stop, like, this man has so much energy. I know. He, I don't know where he stores it, his big toe or something, but that man did not stop moving all night long. And it just made my wife say, so she yeah. just sit there and just, no offense, she wasn't laughing at, well, she was laughing, laughing with you, my friend. It yeah. was great. Yeah. A good time was had by all. Oh, by all. Um, speaking of good times. Apparently, over the years, you guys have had, you know, you guys are the digital photo era. Like, you guys have got lots of stuff. However, only less than 15 seniors have turned in pictures for the senior slideshow. The deadline is mm. tomorrow. All right. Come on, seniors. Let's make this thing I happen. I mean, if I don't get more, like, yeah. I'm, I'm, we I, may just dump the whole thing and do something different. I was about know? to say, there is a Dropbox. Yeah. 
outside of my door in my office for the, you drop off your physical ones. There's an email that you can email them to. You can mm -hmm. uh, even um, submit them to like the digital Dropbox. Right. So there's a lot of people. There's several people have done that. Right. There's like eight or so. And this not. just isn't for you guys. This is for mommy and daddy and grandma and uncle and aunt. They want to see that progression of you from... Yeah, so birth on, I guess you might say, yeah. and graduation is a good culmination of that. So yeah. please get that in. That's important. It's Not, only it's only like three pictures. Right. Baby picture, typically a middle school picture. Right. And then of course a current picture. Right. So you know it's it's one of those wonderful little things. Get those pictures. Get them in. in. Get them in. Uh, let's see. Oh, Lincoln Idol. Now I know this is a little bit old news. <laughs> Lincoln Idol happened two weeks ago. It's not that old. It's, it's not it's that not old, old, but here's the thing. Like, I, I was, this has been a busy two weeks, so I want, before we announced the Lincoln Idol results, I wanted to make sure that I had video clips available online mm -hmm. of most of the performances, and we do. The first AM performance, the audio was a little bad, so we don't have performances from that. But the second one, second set, there were a bunch where we didn't have microphone right. issues. There were some people who actually sang with the microphones cut off. Did you know that? Wow. Yeah, and Did it sound uh, pretty good. No, <laughs> sound was not great on my recording, so those are unfortunately not up there. But for the most part, they're up there, and I apologize. I'm gonna take all the blame for that. Mr. Barton has been holding his tongue. Kids like Aaron Taylor messaged me last night on Facebook, begging like, "When are we gonna know when this is gonna happen?" I was like, "I'll announce it tomorrow," and I have the results. Would you like to know? All right. First off, shout outs and honorable mentions. LCHS Drumline, big shout out, Jared, John, and Jacob. Good Good Special job. honorable mentions, Sam Kirkendall, Alyssa Hager, Raven McCormick, Megan Clay, and Caleb slash Thomas. I guess they got lazy and didn't sorry. want to write your names out. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> All right. You know who you are. You know who you are. Well, that was a really good performance, the, the guitar thing. Uh, I was blown away. Um, here we go. Third place, who goes drum roll? Drum roll. Sparrow McCormick. Woo! She has two performances online. Yep. Uh, I think Jesus Take the Wheel, and I can't think of the other one, the name of the other title, but it is online right now. Mm -hmm. Second place. Lisa Lily Williams. Woo! Unfortunately, hers didn't make it online because the audio <laughs> was bad. But she came in, right. and we re-recorded another one right in here. Good. And she has an MP3 of that, so she can share that with you. Awesome. You guys want to hear it? She'll send awesome. you that that mastered copy. And the winner. And the winner. American Idol leaves. Da -da. Aaron Taylor, first Aaron place. Taylor. Good job, buddy. Aaron. See, he was all nervous. He said he couldn't sleep last night. And I was like, <laughs> just go to bed, dude. We'll announce it in the morning. Get to get it over with. Uh, Pinewood Derby. Now, it uh, looks like the ninth grade uh, Pinewood Derby contestants from Mr. Uh, Mrs. Atkins, Mrs. Fries, Mr. Romero's ninth grade science class. And here they are. Can we flip the thing there? My wonderful assistant who's not switching the slides. Is that Vanna? Uh, if you move your mouse over and click right here, buddy. You'll see. There we go. Oh, right there. Click it one more time. There we go. These are all the cars from the Pinewood Derby. Uh, these are all the uh, all the all the cars that have uh, that competed. If you'll flip to the next slide, with the mouse again, yes, right, right here. Thank you. Oh, all right. Now these are the category winners: best workmanship, Caleb Shelton and Paul Fry; best paint job, Lexi Ross and Amethyst Powers; most unique, Sarah the Bug Barrett and Olivia Roberts. Most School Spirit, Devin Woodrum, Alyssa Biggerstaff, and Tristan Smith. Most Patriotism, Jeff Allen and Samuel Clark. Administrator's Choice, Seth Adkins and Brandon Holly. Unfortunately, I can't tell you which one's which, but they're up there. And if you will flip it to the next slide, this is... Da -da -da, First place winner, Tristan Cooper, for he actually won the race when it went down. So, Tristan. way to go, sir. I'm trying to see if there's anything else. Yes. Senior slideshow, prom. Oh, big one. S3 big dinner tomorrow. Yeah. Actually, today. Today during lunch, you guys will be receiving tickets for attendance, conduct, uh, for your grades, 
and those tickets will get you in. Uh, actually, they'll get you in this uh, tomorrow afternoon for a big dinner. We're going to have a nice celebration. Lasagna. Lasagna. Yes. They're serving lasagna. I'm yes. looking forward to that, my friend. <laughs> um, but we're going to have a big dinner tomorrow afternoon after school. You bring your parents. You guys will come. We're going to have a celebration for all those people who got an A conduct grade, mm-hmm. you know, A or B honor roll, uh, really perfect and faithful attendance. Um, which those numbers are pretty good. I've had lots of conversations with you juniors and seniors and some of you sophomores about not having fun things going on. This is just one of those fun things that we're talking about. And remember, as we said, um, the, the, the more things you do from an academic standpoint and are successful, then the more things that we can do from a fun <coughs> standpoint. So this is our way to kind of give back to you guys and let you know we appreciate all the hard work that you put in this year. Yeah, and looking at, I mean, just look at me. Me coming as an outsider to this school from – you know, from over at the middle school, this this is an academic school. I mean, from our award-winning speech and debate, we've got uh, the kids that do the, the academic bowl stuff. Uh, you know, all these things where people A and B honor roll. It, this is an academic school. And whether you guys believe it or not, that's what this is. Mm-hmm. And you guys are doing a phenomenal job. And we, as things get better, more and more things will happen. Um... I think I've only got one thing left, and that is the daily grind. We'll be grinding to a halt soon. <laughs> I think this will be our last week. We've got a lot of projects. Yes. We've got that S3 video contest and a bunch of other things that we need to work on for the end of the year. So we will not be doing the daily grind after this week. Um, we've got a bunch of other projects to work on. We need to get those done. <laughs> Deadlines are looming, you know, are getting close. So, right. And because of that, we need to give a, a huge shout out to Mr. McCormick here. Uh, put a lot of time, a lot of energy, a lot of effort into this thing. Um, we've been recognized all over, all over the place for this. So, a lot of hard work for him, and we're tickled. Oh, my guys, you guys, yeah, I didn't, come yeah. on, it's my guys, yeah, or gals. It's mostly gals. There's only like two guys. <laughs> come on now. We we get we get Brian. He comes in every once in a while, you know. And our, then, our puppy killer. And then the uh, man behind the scenes. Bryson. He's sitting yeah. over there playing with a zip tie. <laughs> he's playing with a zip tie. He's got a show to run. He's playing with a zip tie. <laughs> high 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 quality over here. And apparently, I'm kicking stuff under the table and breaking it. But uh, with that, guys, that's it for today. We'll see you back here tomorrow. All right, Panthers. Don't forget to follow us up on our YouTube page or tweet us at LCHS Proud.